Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Mono Project. We here at the Mono Project are continuing in our series of, uh, uh, of videos with respect to inspiration, information, education, guidance, advice. And I'm reminded of a story of Rabbi Elimelech of Lezhensk. Now, um, Rabbi Elimelech was a great tzaddik, and uh, Hasidim would gather around him uh, to listen to his words, to his holy words. And one time he was in a, he was in a town, and his carriage was leaving, and a group of Hasidim followed him, escorting him to the, uh, to the gates of the city as he was leaving. And uh, they were walking and singing and praying. And just they were, as they were about to get to the gates of the city, Rabbi Elimelech jumps out of the carriage and walks behind them, joining them. They sing, Rabbi Melech, what are you doing? He says, you were, when I saw the great devotion, the kavana, that great spiritual intent with which you were performing the mitzvah of accompanying me, accompanying your guests as they leave, you were doing that with such, such fervor, with such zeal, with such a spirit and such a holiness that... Uh, I could not bear to be excluded from it. Um, the desire to be with the Creator, the desire to be part of holiness, another person's holiness, is a great thing. When you see um, a tzaddik, a righteous person, um, or someone who's known for his good mitos, his good qualities, and you feel an attraction to, to be with that person, to learn from that person, um, to be a part of that energy, it's a great thing. If you get a chance to listen to someone give a sheer, a lesson, a, a talk, a class, Do what you can to be a part of it. In a previous video, I, um, I, was, uh, I made reference to uh, Reb Zusha Vanipol, who was a glowing coal that was able to light the other coals around him. When you go see uh, a tzaddik, a, a righteous person, a holy person, someone you admire, a religious person that you look up to, and you go uh, listen to him, be with him, that can be a great um, source of inspiration to you and a great source of guidance. Like the coal that is able to ignite from the one beside it, that can happen to you. We're going to be doing more stories with respect to uh, Rabbi Elimelech of Lejens and other Hasidim. Uh, please come back. Please watch. Please learn. Uh, and until next time, on behalf of the Amuna Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.